Claire, stop. You're making a mess. You're not supposed to have this kind of cereal. But Daddy had a bowl. He did? Well, if I had known that, I wouldn't have let him have any either. You're not supposed to buy the sugary cereal anymore. Childhood diabetes is an epidemic. You. What do you mean? I'm right here. What's that smell? Oh, great. Now I've burned the eggs. Come on, Claire. Let's go get you changed. You didn't think we were going to let you wash all those dishes by yourself, did you? Please. It's the least I could do after such a lovely dinner party. Hey, that was all my wife. I can't cook for the life of me. The only way I got her to agree to this was I swore I'd be in charge of kitchen cleanup. And here you are, ruining my promise. Really, I insist. I feel kind of guilty. I haven't had any of Tim's business friends over for dinner yet. I realize I don't really know any of your families very well. I just met your wife and found out her name tonight. Well, we're in the wrong as much as anyone else. Tim's been painting with me for about a year, and for some reason I thought you worked at a shoe store. We really should get together more often. You might get to know me a little better. Okay, well, you've got to let me clean something. <laughs> Think of a reason why. It's way more suspicious if you're hiding something. Seriously, what's going on with you lately? Is it something with work? Yeah, I guess so. I just don't like being so idle. Well, you've got that big house coming up next week, right? Yeah, but the jobs are just coming in slower these days. Go get dressed. Once I take Claire to daycare, you and I can go to breakfast. What does that mean? <laughs> exactly what you think it means. 
I don't know. I just remembered. What is it? I just remembered I was supposed to call Tim about that job next week. Do you want my phone? No, it's okay. I have my own. Hi, Sarah. Do you know who this is? <laughs> Can you see me today? Uh, no, actually, I still don't know where you work. What? Okay, three o'clock at Pete's. For a drive, I'll be back in an hour or two. Alright. You're glad to be rid of me, aren't you? Uh huh. My watch? Remember when I gave that to you? So I know this might be weird, but I got you something. If you pull a whip out of that bag. <laughs> never bought a man a present in life. How many men have you bought presents for? None, actually. <laughs> so I've never bought a man a present he didn't like either. So are you nervous? Here. I didn't get a chance to wrap it. Oh, wow. It's fantastic. I love it. I'm glad. I love you. Are you sure you want to do this? What are you thinking about? I was just thinking of someone doing the can-can. Oh. For a second I thought you were thinking about your wife. 